Hello everyone, I'm Tunzi FX. How are y'all doing? Hope you're all doing great. Today's video I'll be showing us about my strategy. As you can see in your screen. Um my strategy involves moving averages and um RSI. I'll be using this strategy for a long time as it has been paying off. It doesn't disappoint me anytime I use it. So far you follow the rules of the strategy, it's plays out very well for me it plays out good i'm always winning with my strategy as you can see right here i'm trading volatility 25 index this is five minutes time frame like i always say this is um one minute time frame let me show you this strategy works on all time frames it works on all time frames as you can see now i entered at this point i entered right here at this point just right here when the market crossed over now with this my strategy like i usually say in my videos this is my strategy this rsi and moving averages i usually say that you can see right here the crossover happened just about hold on crossover happened right here as you can see also what happened right here this brown moving average crossed below this blue moving average and the red moving average the brown moving average is a small period moving average so it moves faster than other moving averages so when it crosses below the other two moving averages crossed below the blue one here and also the red one now i it's, it's an alert for me it's a cue for me to do something to get a lot to, to be ready to sell but well, before i sell i will need a confirmation so right here i come to my rsi so as at this point of the crossover my rsi right here is reading below 50. as you can see it's reading below 50. just after the crossover happened right here crossover happened just right here my rsi is reading below 50. reading below 50 here so it's telling me, oh sorry, the RSI has already been reading below 50 right from this point. As you can see, it has been below 50 for even before the crossover, the strength of the market has been downwards. So now I check my RSI reading below 50 and again, I look at my these two moving averages in my indicator window. A crossover has happened as well. This red moving average has crossed below the blue moving average. As you can see, can you see it? Can you see it right here? Can you see? A crossover has happened between these two moving averages. As you can see, a crossover has happened and I sold. I placed my sell trade. And I'm in profit. Now, this um strategy works on all time frames. This is one minute. For the scalpers, it's a very good strategy. For the swing traders, it's a good strategy. For the day traders as well is a very nice strategy as you can see i'm in profit the market is falling so i'm going to exit this trade if and if this small time period moving average crosses above these two moving averages so i'm going to come to my one minute time frame and be checking so what Whenever this particular moving average, this brown, crosses above this one, this red, and also crosses above the blue moving average, then I will be looking to exit my trade and think about buying. But I will not buy yet until my RSI is reading above 50. And also, there's been a cost over here already. And also, when the red moving average has crossed above the blue moving average here, I'm going to exit the trade. So that is how this strategy works it gives you entry and exit point as you can see i mean a very nice profit so this strategy is 99.9 percent .9 reliable i assure you that now let me show you another another chart volatility 75 index now as you can see on this this is volatility 75 index markets falling falling and going up as you can see right here now if you are going to sell this trade now when the crossover happened just above here 
it happened here you place your sell trade and your stop loss will be above the moving averages above them so you can see on my um trade right here as you can see my stop loss is above the moving averages so i don't expect market to come to this zone and market didn't come because the moving averages has already crossed below so it's signal that a downtrend is about to happen a downward movement is about to begin now so I've, i'm going to place my um, stop loss here so market didn't come there i never even expected market to come to that area so as i was talking about volatility 75 index and i was talking about right here if you place yourself just right here when the crossover happened um yeah the crossover happened just about here you place yourself and you place your stop loss about here now as you can see the market kept falling and falling so this particular trade i'm going to exit at this point i'm just rather i will go to my one minute time frame as a scalper if you are scalping you scalp with one minute and five minutes time frame mostly so at this point at this point here look at where the, the fall begin falling and falling and falling so at this point i'm just going to close my trade right here now the cost has already happened that is the brown moving average has crossed above the blue moving average and the red moving average and as you can see my average is reading above 50 that's a buy signal that's a buy momentum and also there's also been a crossover above here as well so i'm going to close or exit that trade as at this point so there's one particular thing i want to show us on um volatility 75 index yes this is it look at how this market fell the movement started from here the fresh movement started from here as you can see from this point the crossover happened and the market started falling started falling if you notice the market keeps on falling the market keeps on keeps on touches uh, touching the um the moving average and keeps on bouncing off it keeps on falling so this trade for scalpers as you make profit at this point you close it when the market when he when the the can the price bounces off this moving average on your one minute time frame there's going to be another um it's a very long it's a very bright chart because one minute time frame the candle forms every one minute so on your one minute time frame there's going to be yes right here on your one minute time frame as you can see the cost of has happened above it's telling you to exit the trade so you exit the trade and again the, the moving average causes below again you place yourself you keep on selling and selling and hold on to the market or you close it again at this point you feel like oh this is a crossover right here let me close the trade market might buy again market crosses below again you place your sell again since your rsi is already reading below 50 the momentum is 50. now the momentum is is, is, uh, is downward sorry now um right here again also a crossover below again so you keep on selling taking your profit selling at taking your profit whenever there's a crossover above these two moving average that is there's crossover when this brown moving average crosses above these two moving averages that is when you exit your trade to be on the safer side as you can see market keeps on falling and falling so this strategy is very very reliable works on all time frames works on all time frames it works for all financial assets as you can see this is one hour time frame just look how massive the market fell at this point this is where the cost of our point and market kept on falling and falling and falling and didn't you look back to this point so this strategy is very very reliable you can use it for currency pairs you can use it for indices use it for indexes and whatever financial asset you are trading so um, that is all about this video thank you for watching my video kindly subscribe to my channel have a nice day